Hey, how's it going everyone? This is DCSG81 and in this video, um, it's like an add-on to my previous one for the head swapping of Tor and uh, there's three things that I would like to talk about. The first thing is to correct a mistake which I made and some of you pointed it out to me. I'm very glad that you pointed it out. The second one is something that I've forgotten to try on. And the third one is something that I've forgotten to mention. So let's get to the first one, which is about this tall Mesco Ragnarok head. Because whenever that I remove it, it comes out together with the neck. And I always, always forgotten that it's actually a two piece and not one piece. Okay. So some of you actually told me that why don't I remove it and I try it. Yeah, so this is something that I, I forgotten and I thank you that you, you guys actually uh, reminded me about it. So which means that I will have to try on this head on all the four bodies again for you guys. And also I'll need to try on the rest of the heads which you can see right now <laughs> onto this body because it have a neck now. So yeah, so this is uh, my mistake. So let's get on to it. Okay, so the very first one I'm going to try is to try on the Mesco tall head without the neck this time onto each of the body which again, like I mentioned previously, I don't think it will work on this SHV Quartz Age of Ultron uh, body Okay, so it doesn't look good Now let's try on the uh, Infinity War SHV Quartz tall Okay, uh, yep, I tried this previously on my video that I mentioned in my previous video yeah it doesn't really looks that good because the head seems to be a little bit too big okay and now let's try on the new one the Avengers Endgame Tor okay well it's almost very similar case to the Infinity War yeah it still looks a little too big for the body even with the, the beer guts okay yep so this head are uh, not really useful for other bodies except for the, the original body okay so now let's try on the remaining heads that we have onto the Mesco body this one I know that it will be too tiny okay <laughs> okay then we will try on we I'll keep the best for the last which is uh, this one try the uh, SHV Guards one first nope not good Try on the maniple, not good as well. Now let's try on the uh, end game tour with the neck this time. And nah, uh, yep, not good. Okay, okay, this one might work because uh, it has a big one. This is from Marvel Legends, and it has a big uh, neck joint as well. And let's see if it works. Okay. Wow, somehow it fits. Not perfectly, but it does fit. Yep, just go in. Yep, doesn't fall out. Okay, if this is what you're looking for, it's quite good, <laughs> I would say. Okay, now let's try with. Oh, see? It fitted quite well until the ball joint stuck to it. Okay, now let's try on the, uh, the one with the shades. Yep, somehow it fitted quite well. Wow. I am surprised. This looks pretty good actually. Wow. Okay. I might keep my tall in this form. <laughs> it's looking pretty good though. Yeah. Okay. So this is the first thing that I would like to correct on. And now let's move on to the second things. Okay, so the second things that I say that I've forgotten to try it on is with regards to this Avengers Endgame head, the SHV Guards, on to the uh, Infinity War. What I did was I just I just show it to you guys like this that I say it looks pretty good, but I didn't really you know try to snap it on. Okay, some of you asked whether it does the ball joint actually fits. Now let's try. Okay. Yep, we go in as well and actually fits. See? Okay, and the hair, I put on the hair as well, the second piece. Yep, fits on pretty good. Okay. So if for 
if I'm not wrong, it's the Sentinel, right? <laughs> yeah, if I remember you correctly, you say you wanted this look, so your wish come true, it does fit very, very well. Okay. Okay, let's move on to the third things that I say I've forgotten to mention. Okay, so for the third things that I say I've, I've forgotten to mention is that there will be a release for the um, this tall head from Manipal, which is the Flashback Studio. Uh, I can't say for sure that they will come out with that because so far they have only shown the 3D uh, version of it is the uh, non-colored 3D printing that you can see on the screen right now. Yeah, so this is what they have teased so far. I keeping my finger crossed that they will release it because it looks pretty good even without the the color printing on it. Yeah, so yep, I'm not saying that this head scalp is bad. Just that as we all know that the uh, maniple always give us something really really good. So I really hope that they will actually release that. But so far there's nothing concrete because they only show that's the only picture that they tease so far. So once they tease one that with the uh, fully colored, then you can be 90% sure that they will actually release it for pre-order. Yep. So now we, we, I can't say for sure because some of you actually asked me whether is there any better hits that will be released like Nota Studio or uh, uh, Takara Tony. But I, I remember that um, Manipal is the one that have teased so far. Takara Tony, I don't think so. And as for Nota Studio also, I d haven't seen him making any. Yep, there's the there, there's another one that have uh, made it, which is the uh, Hong Hong Cops, the one that I buy I, I bought my uh, Iron Man head and also the War Machine head. Yeah, he he actually released one that I will show you some pictures on the screen now. Yeah, so I didn't get that one from him because I was waiting for this one. Yeah, so if you are interested you can actually contact him okay so yep this is uh, just a very short video that I hope to update you guys on the uh, mistake that I made and something which I have not tried on and also something I forgot to mention so I hope you find this video uh, informative and useful for you for your knowledge I uh, hope you give me a thumbs up if you like it and of course leave me any questions that you have or anything that I actually forgotten again to try it on let me know and of course, uh, I hope you can subscribe to my channel if you have not and also click on the bell button so that you won't miss out any of my latest video which I upload pretty much every day. <laughs> okay, until then I'll see you in my next review. Bye.